Happy Christmas Eve Eve, everybody. Hope everybody's doing good. We're going to play some uh, slots for a little bit. It's all free money, so who knows how long it's going to last. <laughs> Might have to switch it back to uh, to golden tea after, but we'll see how this goes. I didn't update my notification, but I did push it out, so yeah, it's changed now. All right, let's give this a shot. Bonus would be nice, right? I don't know. You know about this game in particular. It's coins for the bonus, and then lots of buffaloes is also really high thing. One more coin. Nope, just a bunch of buffaloes at the end. Does nothing. A little low, that's better. There we go. Coin. Come on, coin. Oh, that was there. More coin. It's gonna give it to me, maybe. Doesn't want to give it. Bad with the tens, but still. Nothing good's happened, jeez. Let's see what the problem is. 
surprised at her. hitting tens, but there's really not a ton with it. Losing money quick. Getting wrecked. No bonus rounds. Bonus rounds would be nice. <clears throat> Three spins, come on. What's up, River Darts? How's, how's it going, man? Happy Christmas Eve, Eve. This is, uh, what is this? Lightning, Lightning Link slots. It's not, it's not a uh, real casino money one. It's fake. Can't go to the casino anymore because you know we have a newborn. So I was like, ah. Let's play a little bit of Buffalo and see. get the casino feel at home for a little bit. Play some slots. But the free 10 million is going quick, so I'm not putting real money into this. Three coins would be nice for the bonus, though. Yeah, they're. It, it might be the same, uh, I mean, I'm sure it's the same game in the back end, right? But it's just, um, just an app, Android app. I have so many candies. Okay, what are we unlocking? You have to feed the deer, really. Interesting. I guess we gotta feed the deer some candy, huh? Okay. Hundred and twenty five thousand fake coins. Sweet. These freemium games are great. <laughs> Reminds me of the South Park episode. 
with uh, Canada. Harrison Phillips freemium game. If we get three coins, that'd be nice. Bonuses are always fun, even if they're fake and not for real money. More coin? Come on. Oh, it was in that reel. Yeah, it was in that reel. They're not going to give me free games. A lot of buffaloes in that last reel. We went to the zoo tonight. That was fun. They um, they decorated up for Christmas. Have a bunch of activities and things you can walk through, and you know, decorate a cookie and take a picture with Santa. It was a lot of fun. Went with, brought the kids and nieces and nephews, and our our little boy went. Oh man, this this ten million is going a lot faster than the. Uh, I wanted. Let's see what rewards we have. Can we get some money there? Might have some extra cash in here. Extra fake cash. Thousand. All right, man, you too. Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate it. Have a great Christmas and a great New Year's, but I'll catch you before then. Thanks. On coin, nope. Collect forty nine cougars. Ah, A couple buffaloes in there, that would have been big. Might be switching to golden tea pretty quick here. I was thinking we could get some some play time out of this, but I don't know. Not really getting any 
anything. Been a lot of cougars across and then a few buffaloes in the front there. Pretty good one. Buffalo, 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 oh. Buffalo! It's 40. All the big numbers, like real life, that would have been 64 bucks on a $10 spin, right? They just put the large numbers in these games to make you think you're doing something fun and special. You little ripper. <laughs> Come on. Ah. Collect 57 buffaloes. They're not a lot of them are coming. So. so you don't even have to actually get them, you just have to be on the board for that uh, side challenge. It's cool. What up, Johnny? How you doing, man? I figured we'd play some uh, slots for a little bit, because I can't go to the casino anymore, or at least for a while, until the, until the boy gets a little older. But, you know, you start with 10 million free fake coins, and then I'm not putting any real money into it, so let's see how far we can get, how much time we can get out of it. Happy Christmas Eve, Eve, man. Hope you're uh, having a good night, getting ready for all the festivities over the next couple days. If you celebrate Christmas, that is. Oh, I got the coin. All right. Three coins for the spins. So let's see if it's like the real slot machines where if you get two, oh. Team free games, wild two or four, two or five. Let's let's do nine free with two and five. But if you, you get two coins, you get a retrigger. I hope. I guess we'll see, right? One of nine is it gonna retrigger? Yep. All right, cool. So it is like the real slot machine at least. Now we just need some buffaloes. Yeah, man. I. <laughs> I started prepping the, the brisket uh, yesterday. I'm going to smoke it tomorrow so it's ready Christmas Day. It should be, should be awesome. I think it's a good tradition. <laughs> Who doesn't like brisket? Well, any time of the year. So yeah, uh, that'll be ready to roll up on the smoker. Uh, tomorrow, when the football game starts, uh, I'll probably start that process. Give it, give it a good twelve to fourteen hours or so. Yeah, man, it, it's it is a treat. I love it. I mean, I love all meat, really, but brisket's uh, 
uh, a good favorite because my camera's a little too. To the top of my head, I guess. There you go. Do it five times, but it was only one buffalo. That's Well, that didn't work out too well. We'll get the rewards when we need the money. We don't need it yet. But it took seven million to get. Oh, come on. Buffalo. Oh. Took seven million to get one free bonus round there. Free spins. That was a good one. Coin. Do it again. Nope. Yeah, it is. It is an Android app. Uh, this one is called Lightning Link. Yeah, this one's Lightning Link. So it's just a you know little casino app. There's there's quite a few of them out there actually, um, where you just get the casino game. It would be cool on a touch screen. If I had a touchscreen monitor in this, I'd just sit here and you could push the buttons. But I mean, yeah, because it's because I'm using the Android emulator, you're just using the mouse, basically. I was one buffalo off from a good round there. Same buffalo there. That's a pretty big win for some buffaloes. Maybe some jacks were in there too. I don't know what the uh, right side bar is going to do when it gets to the top. So let's hopefully we find out soon. You think it'd be cool because it's been sitting there for a while. But yeah, once the once this money runs out, I'll I'll switch it over to Golden Tea and we'll play some Golden Tea. I mean, unless we hit something massive, that'd be kind of fun. Dud. Eagles? Don't forget to claim your rewards. I don't know what these bolts do. All right, let's see what we got in here. Let's open them all. That would be good. Only a hundred thousand.
That was a pretty good chunk of change there in free game with free coins. So. Five million might keep us going for a little bit. Coin. Oh, it was in there. Got it. Let's do the two and four. Let's go twelve free games this time. Two coins retrigger. Come on. About times four, but only one button. Get jacks. that was. Time for jacks. I don't know how it's counting the buffalo there, but yeah. That was just the first two. Trigger. One more. Oh, one more. The so three should give us an extra uh, eight. And you get the coins times four. Take that. Jeez. Bunch of nothing. All the way across times two, that's not bad. A few more games. Unless we get a retrigger, nice. Three. Wait, is it four or five? It's five. Wasn't bad. All right, we'll 
do do a couple more spins, and then we'll we'll switch it to uh, the golden tea. We've been playing this for feels like a long time, but maybe not that long. Thirty minutes. Yeah. All right, we'll take it down to six million or another bonus round. Let's see. All right, last spin. Let's change it up, play some golden tea. Let's do the daily real quick. Let me update the stream so it's not marked mature. Apparently the gambling tag under uh, Twitch gets marked mature. Oh, 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 that was close. Paladin sent me one. Let's play him. Wow. I don't like that course either. <laughs> yeah, man, I was just doing slots for a little bit. I guess I could have kept going, but I figured... Uh, Golden Tees, I guess, a little bit more interactive for everybody. <laughs> or it might be a little bit more interesting. I don't know. It's not real money, so it's not like you're watching uh, the other slot people out there trying to win real money. But yeah, we got your match right here. If you're, I don't know what you're doing, man. If you want to throw some out, we can um, play for a bit. We went, uh, why not both? <laughs> I, I could, yeah. If I could run, if this computer was better, I could run two instances of the Android emulator. But it's, I, don't have, I don't have a great computer in the, uh, the arcade. How's your night going, man? Happy Christmas Eve, Eve. You getting ready for Christmas? All right. Starting to get windy outside. Oh, that's cool. Wrapping presents is always... That's the uh, fun part, right? 
takes the longest. Where'd you, did you put the server in your house or did you like put it up out in the club? Knowing you, you probably had a piece of hardware that was sitting around. You're like, yeah, this is good enough. I imagine you don't need much for a Minecraft server. Oh. Really missed that putt the first time. Depends on the mods, really. You know, I never, never played Minecraft. I thought about it. Like, hmm, I should check this out. And then I never did. Kind of like The Sims, like, for me. Like, I used to play The Sims a bunch. And then, I don't know. I guess I got older, and I was like, eh. I have a real life that I need to live, but I don't need to keep my sim alive. And they have a better life than me. I think it's raining outside. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. Your kids are into it. It's something you guys can all do together. I guess I always just thought you were... Um, I, don't, I don't know. I, I guess I, I didn't know there was a story. Or is there a story or it's just like tasks? Hey, what are you barking at? Good girl. Half of my dog was in the, well, one of the dogs. We just walked out of their doghouse to bark at somebody <laughs> across the street. Half of her, half of her was in the doghouse, the other house, the other half was standing, barking. Oh man, missed those two putts. Alan, you got a chance on this one. Not good. We should we should do a versus stream. Like you like you guys' pinball streams would do it with uh golden tea. That'd be fun. Do a tournament. We'd have to get enough people interested in playing it. It doesn't matter what device you're on, I guess, either. That's right, Christmas is on Monday. Different. Yeah, we could do something, right? People are shooting fireworks right now? Why? Is that just something people do on Christmas or, or around Christmas? I mean, I figured any place that would do it is Texas, and I don't hear any. Are well, we going to roll on the green? No, it's close. All right.
Yeah, it's Johnny. It, it is. Um, I don't want to say smart, but yeah, it's, it's a good idea to do the challenges, get used to. Yeah, some of them are are tough, but yeah, get get yeah, work on your uh, skills of it going through the challenges. Uh, that's weird, Paladin. I mean, they're legal year round here, and people. I mean, New Year's, people do it. And, I mean, obviously, Fourth of July. I don't, I don't remember hearing any on Christmas last year, but maybe. Oh, man. But maybe there will be. I don't know. It's going to be a tough shot. Might not make it over. Oh, I did. We were supposed to get rain during the day today, and we didn't. We got like a little bit, you know, a little bit of drizzle here and there, but not like they were kind of forecasting. But maybe it's late and coming now. I don't know, but it's 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 sprinkling a little bit out there right now. All right, I'm gonna send the Paladin one, Johnny. Send you one. Play it if you want. And let's do a league matchup. Let's see what happens. Nice. Paladin, are you still getting snow right now, or did it let up? Freezing rain. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, that might not be good. Most of it melted. Okay. Yeah, sweet, Johnny. Um, I think I'll be home most of Christmas Eve day. And then, like I said, I got to come. We're, we're going to go over to uh, Rachel's mom's house, hang for a bit. Probably, probably do dinner there, like just a quick dinner. And then I, I gotta come. I gotta come back and start the uh, brisket. So. But yeah, most of the day slash night, I'll be here. Football's gonna be rolling up. So. Got to cheer on my fantasy, my one fantasy team that's still in the uh, championship bracket. If I get a win. I'm in the finals. That'll be cool. The championship game. Yeah. 
I should bring the belts on stream out so you guys can see them at some point. In both leagues, I, I bought belts. Yeah, Niners on Monday, man. Uh, the claw machine is, it does have quite a bit of stuff in it. So yeah, when the kids come by, I, I don't, I don't know if anybody's going to come by on Christmas. Maybe we'll get, maybe some people will come tomorrow uh, or Monday night. Yeah. For the game, maybe some people will come by, but that's, yeah, that's an important, it's an important game for the 49ers and it's, and it's an important game for my fantasy playoff team, so I'll be really watching that for a lot of reasons. Ooh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to squeak this through. I might be able to. Yeah, just a little fun. Oh man, I almost dropped right in. Uh, but yeah, I printed um, just some fun stuff for everybody on the three D printer. I got them uh, one round going now, and then I got to do another couple tomorrow while we're while we're home. Uh, but I printed. Um, See if you guys can see these. I printed a bunch of these. Whoop. There we go. So there's like a Texas. I mean, it's probably in more places than Texas, but when you're passing somebody on these small roads, give them the little peace sign as you pass. <laughs> so I got three of them done. I'm going to print three more. They're, it's going right now. And then I got to do some more. Croc charms for everybody. Printing everybody's initials so they can put them on their Crocs. They actually turned out really good. I was impressed. And then, I don't know. I might have time tomorrow before Christmas to print a few more things. Yeah, they turned out pretty cool. But yeah, I might have enough time to print some more things just to... You know, a lot of our, all of the, uh, all my nieces and nephews out here are younger, younger kids, right? They're nobody's a teenager yet, uh, so they get a kick out of this stuff. So just kind of print stuff for them. It's not a Christmas present or anything. It's just a little fun thing that they can play with. Oh, I missed it twice. I'm going to do the... Beans yelled at me for doing this last night. Oh, I missed it again. It doesn't look like it's breaking that much to the left, but I did push it both times. Are they... Um, like stands, so when like you're on the table or something, you can just put it on it. That's that's a good idea too. Tablet holders. Oh yeah, the oh you suck. Yeah, the rain waited until now start coming down. The, uh, the roof of the game room is metal. I mean, the whole structure is metal. So it, when it's raining, it sounds really freaking cool. Oh, really? I 
Did did any of your uh, your kids get it, Paul? Or was it just you? Hopefully, I mean, once it's in the family, it's kind of fair game, right? Once one person has it. Hopefully nobody else got it, but Oh look at that, that was a good shot. You've been hiding in the basement. That's good, man. I mean it it, it sucks that you, you can't be around your family right now because of it. But at least nobody else got it, I guess. Did they pass you your presents like through the basement door or like just leave them on the ground and then you had to go get them? Ah, somebody is shooting fireworks actually right now. I don't think it's bugging my dogs. They might not be doing a ton. Ooh. Ah. You guys want to come in? I don't know if you guys can hear it. We have a, I don't know, you might be able to hear it in here. That's good, man. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. That sucks, dude. And yeah, I mean, you don't want to, especially somebody that's going through cancer treatments, you don't want to be around and. What a shit disease, dude. Like, that's a bug. <laughs> Let's hope it stays that way, right? Once uh once you get a little bit <laughs> You don't want to go outside, it's raining. Yeah. Ooh. I may or may not have beaten this guy. I guess we'll see. His name's I play bad, that's cool. Paul accepted the match. Let's do it. I mean, yeah, it's super raining outside right now. Why do you want to go out there? At least the rain waited until we got home from the zoo. Oh, that's in the water. Oh, it got over. Because that part would have sucked if it was raining when we were at the zoo. It's like a downpour right now.
yeah, we went to the went to the zoo where they do. They call, I guess it's zoo lights. They they um, decorate the zoo in Christmas lights, and Santa's there for pictures. Um, they have like cookie making station. You can walk in. It's uh, the H E B is a grocery store out here. I'm sure it's in other places uh, in this area, or not just Texas. I don't know. And uh, they provide the cookies and the icing and everything. And um, the little ice skating rink. You know, it's just it's a cool little little thing to go do. That's you don't have to pay a ton of money to get into it. I think it costs us eighteen bucks. Uh, for my wife and I and, and, our, and our little guy. Uh, so yeah, her, her sister and kids and husband went and grandma or, or you know, my wife's mom and my wife's aunt. So yeah, a lot of fun. Walk around. Mason got to see all the lights, got to take some pictures. And then he uh, he sat on his cousin's lap and took a picture with Santa. That was cool. And then he fell asleep. <laughs> he was... He was so excited. There was so much going on. Okay, that he fell asleep. And then he woke up right as we were uh, getting ready to leave. Don't chew on it. Cool. I have my uh yeah, Christmas zoo is awesome, dude. Um when cool. when Rachel's sister lived in Washington. Uh, just just above the Oregon border, we would go, you know, visit them a couple times around Christmas, and we would go to the zoo there. And they did, you know, a similar thing where they just dress the zoo up as Christmas, and they're just lights, and it's a cool. I mean, the the Portland Zoo was was a zoo. There's so many freaking people there, but the zoo here uh, in Abilene. It actually, it actually wasn't, I mean, it was packed, but it really wasn't that bad. Like, you're not, you don't feel super claustrophobic. Um, but yeah, so we, we went to the Portland Zoo, and, and it was kind of like that. So now it's a, it's going to be a yearly thing here for us when we're, when we're here at Christmas, which I think will be all the time. But, uh, but yeah, it was fun. A lot of fun. You need a dog cam? Uh, so, here, I'll just move the camera. They, uh, I used to have this, this mat. Can you see her? Yeah. I used to have this, this dart, my dart mat out, but I, I, you know, we haven't been really been using it because I had the laser thing. But she used to lay on this in our old house because it was out in our garage. So she, she saw it, and now look at her. She's just... Super content. Good girl. That's charcoal. Bailey, come here. Bailey, come here. That's the other dog. That's Bailey. She's a red healer. But yeah, I let him in just because it was raining. Normally they, they're fine outside. You know, they'll come in here for a bit. Um... But yeah, like I said, it's raining. I'm not going to leave them outside in the rain. They have their they have dog houses and they're under. So we have a um, an awning that's over the patio that's built like literally right right outside the the door right behind me. This wall. So their dog houses are there, and you know they're not exposed to like the rain. It 
just sitting in it. Oh, she does? Yeah, she's loving the mat, dude. Oh, that's sweet, man. That's tough. You know, the dog. Yeah. She's going to go to sleep on the mat, I bet. They got sprayed by a skunk a, a few weeks back. Look at that. I, I, wa I walked out of the game room one night. And their, their food's right out here. And there was something in there eating it. And I was like, oh, shit, what is that? And I thought it was a cat. No, it was a skunk. So a couple days after, uh, I just hear, whoa, 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 whoa. Is, they're going bananas after something in the, in the backyard. And then you walk out and you smell skunk. And I was like, oh, no. They got sprayed. So I went and... Oh, man, that's not good. Uh, so, I, you know, I, I cleaned them off the best I could. Got the water and the soap. But it was cold. So I, I couldn't, like, really get into them. It, so it kind of lingered. And you can still kind of smell it on them a little bit. I didn't, you know, it was freezing outside. I'm like, man, I don't want to bathe the dogs and then... So I, I ended up doing like a half-assed job on them, just to get most of the stink out. Yeah, I, I got massively toasted on this hole. Bowden might might get a win. problem there is I used the mulligans early, right? So you want to keep them for a hole that you might need it on, and I was supposed to really pay attention to that, so yeah, minus three is not a good look there. Get to it, Paul. You only got to beat a minus three on that. I don't know why this that thing keeps coming up. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's do... Do I have a daily shot? No, let's do the daily shot, and then we'll play another random match. Paladin, if you want to send a match, or if you... I don't know what you're doing. Are, are you actually playing them right now, or...? If you're playing them, I'll send more than one. If you want. I mean, I don't know what you're doing. I know it's, you know, midnight where you're at. I was just coming on to stream a little bit tonight. Yeah, you're playing? Okay, I'll send, uh, I'll send, I'll send a few. I'll just play. I'll just play against you. Do you have a lot of silver? Well, no, I don't want it. I don't need it. Uh, let's see something that we're close at, close to each other at. Or which was the one you beat me on? Is it going to show me? No, it's not showing me. Oh, got some thunder. Uh, this one's close. I'm, I'm only a shot ahead of you average, so... Play that one. Oh, you sent me another one? Okay. Too good, or you want to do do one more? I'll send you one more. All 
I was trying to pick one where our scores were kind of close to each other. Minus 2.2 .2 and minus 1.8. I think that might be the closest. Yeah. All right, let's do Cape Cavern. All right. Bailey, Bailey, come here. Sure. Let me pull the mat out for you guys. Oh, 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 oh. There you go. Now you both can lay on it. Go ahead. Yeah, I had the I had that mat up in our attic. Because like I said, I wasn't using it. And um, oh, that's now that I have the game room built, I've been cleaning. Oh, that was really bad. Oh, I got a mulligan that. I've been cleaning stuff up, moving stuff out here that should be out here. And I was like, oh, yeah, that our dart mat, mat is out up in the attic. Lurking in bed. Nice. What was 8K, Calvin? Yeah, now we got both the dogs on there. Good girls. What are you doing? No, you're fine. Yeah, you your pinball machines are in the basement, right, Paul? So all your streams are from Basement Central. I wish I had a basement. I, I've never uh, I've never lived in a house that's had a basement. It always seemed to be like the cool spot for a game room and i mean listen i'm not complaining about the you know detached game room that i have um i just basements always seem kind of cool to me oh man it's not good These sand traps suck to get in these. Yeah. Do you have a basement in your house, Johnny? I know, like, San Francisco, Daily City, like you had some of the, some of the houses at least in Daily City. Um, I want to say it was my great aunt's house or my great aunt and uncle's house where they had. I mean, it wasn't like a basement like you. you would think but it was like a lower floor like your main floor you, you walked up to because the, you know the streets are so steep and then you would walk down to the garage area so i mean it's not really a, a basement i guess Oh, come on. I had to hit that full power, and I didn't, just because I thought it was going to go too far. Is 
That's worth it. The mulligan. Um, that's, I mean, sometimes they have sales and you can buy them, but that's it. Damn, thousand square foot, full bath, dude. That's awesome. I, I mean, I'd live down there. That's pretty sweet, man. That's the one thing that kind of like. I wish I would. I wish I could have like a, a bathroom in here. Or just, you know, a little toilet with a sink. But actually, it was funny. I, I saw somebody selling, um, uh, what do they call them? It's not a, it, it's not a porta potty. It was like a legit bathroom that you can put outside and it'll turn, like, it'll tie into your septic. And I was like, damn, that would be smart put it out like right around here somewhere but i wouldn't want to look at it that's you know i'd have to kind of have it hidden enough that it just doesn't you know it's not an eyesore if, if i was going to do it going to do it and then i don't know if, you know my wife would want to do it like we don't have a lot of property so we're not like you have to walk a mile to get back to the main house. I just don't like stopping when I'm gaming. I don't like going far away. Oh, weak. Super weak. Hard that last hole. Yeah. You, it, it's, yeah, you got to do the daily, do the daily nines. Cause I think in the last chest of the daily nine, you get, you get it. Um, your oldest son and the mother-in-law live down there. That's, Dude, see, that's like super multi-purpose. You're taking care of your kid, your family, and you got a game room. Oh, no, that's not too personal, bro. Um, it, this is my first first kid, first baby boy. Um, he's He's been so awesome. Yeah, he's a lot of fun. He's starting to find his voice. So my wife, uh, my wife will say like, he, you know, he's like screaming like a pterodactyl. I mean, it's kind of what it sounds like, man. It's uh, it is exciting. Thank you. Three times. That's not good, Uh But yeah, he's just he's just starting to find his voice. So he likes to be in. Spots that are kind of echoey in the house. So we have a couple spots in, or like really one spot in our master bedroom where it's like really echoey and, and he loves it. He'll just kind of like lay there and just scream. And uh, there's another spot in the living room where he's kind of found it. But yeah, it's, he's starting to be more vocal be more active it's just it's such a cool thing to see he, and he's he's happy he's always always smiling if he's crying it's because he something's up like diaper food and i don't even think he's really you know in a lot of pain with his teeth because he's got teeth coming in now he's got two teeth already so um, you know i'm hoping he's not in a ton of pain but you know we don't know 
So we can only assume that it's hurting them a little, hopefully not a lot. So it'll be it'll be fun when he can tell us. As I'm sure, I mean, you guys know, right? Both of you guys have been through this. This is my first experience. I mean, I, I've had my nieces and nephews, and I've seen them grow up. And then I've seen now, I've seen uh, Crystal's, or Rachel's kids, or Rachel's nieces and nephews grow up. Crystal's her sister, her kids. That's where I was going with that. Uh, I've seen them grow up. That's so been kind of cool, but different when it's your own, I guess, is what I'm what I'm saying. Oh, so you're on the you're on the way out, man. You're you're at the end of your duties. That's got to be an exciting. Exciting feeling, too. You and your wife have any big plans? <laughs> when the last one is an adult? All right, you're all on your own. Mom and I are retiring to Alaska to get away from you. <laughs> you got any big big things? Even I mean, it doesn't have to be like a permanent big thing, but I'm sure there's like a celebration in there, right? As much... For the for the kid as as for you and your wife, the final third. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, Paladin had a had a gap. I don't. I mean, I a lot of I, I don't think there's any I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. Obviously, that's not what I'm that's not what I'm saying. It's like I don't know if I. Like, I'd be half excited that one's 18 and then thinking, all right, the second one, oh, yeah. He's not. I still, I still got another seven, eight year. No, I know. Now, now you're just, uh, you're in it, right? You don't have as much of a freedom as maybe you thought when you just had the first one, right? Like, you're like, hey, what? We circled this date on our calendar. And we're expecting to be kid free in 2023 or 2024. <laughs> nah, all, all kids are a blessing, right? So I just, I started old. Or older, I guess. I'm I'm forty, so if we're doing another one, it's it's gotta happen quick. I'm only getting older. What now? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's it's a valid question, though. What do what are we doing now? Yeah, I, that's awesome, Paul. I, I know you wouldn't change a thing. I, we talk a lot on a personal level. It's just uh. I mean, you you guys did it way before me, right? So, like I said, I'm 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 40, and I'm like, all right, this is uh, getting to the end of my time here. I don't want to be 70, and my my kids are just barely adults. By the time I'm 58, Mason will be an adult. You know, right around retirement age, I, I hope, right? Is is kind of 
where I'd like it to be, but, you know. It's never always going to work out the way you want it to, plan to. Wait, oh, I thought I had that. I don't know why I decided to choose such a short club in the beginning. That was weak. Oh no. Oh, it got up. Oh, that was close. Last couple of matches. Got Paladin on the minus three one. Yeah, that that hole was tough, dude. For that that entire course. And why does this keep popping up? I need to restart the app. Uh, let's see if that one guy beat me. I did get him. All right. He tried. All right, let's play Pine Coast. Oh, it must be. You're having the same issue? Okay. So, yeah, it's got to be a server bug issue. I haven't seen that happen before, so. All right, we're going to upgrade the clubs against you, Valor. Not that it's really going to. Yeah, I don't think it's going to help that much. And the rain just keeps coming down. What are you doing, pup? Hi. Cool. She was just coming over to say thank you for taking her out of the rain. nice and warm in here. Oh, nice. Pretty sure it's going to end up in a bunker. Oh, it didn't even make it up the hill. Thanks, Johnny. Paladin, yeah. You'll get there. Dude, like I said, when I when I first started playing against uh Fiends, he just he destroyed me. 
And then once you get more comfortable with it, it's like, okay. You get your clubs upgraded as you play. And, it, you know, the whole... The whole thing will change, I promise. Oh, yeah, it's coming down now. Can you guys hear the rain? And that's loud. I just don't know if the microphone picks it up. Yeah. I dig it. It's only getting worse. Oh, cool. oh, oh, it stayed up. It's okay. The dog is like, just walked up right to me like there's, they're scared. Sorry, right, bud. Oh, what the hell was that? That was way off. What's wrong? I know you, you don't want to go outside. It's raining. Yeah. She st stands at the door and like, oh. Let me out, open the door, and she's like, nope, never mind. Oh no, I was way too far. See, this is a bad green to do that on, because what am I going to do? Put over the sand trap? We got to take the shot again. And do less. I hope it doesn't go in the water. Ended up in the sand. What a horrible hole. Ah, <laughs> nice. No, it's not game noise, yeah. Yeah, that's the one thing I've noticed out here that's different from, like, California. I mean, it rains everywhere, but it's like a deluge. You'll get just a massive amount, like right now. it's We're going to get an inch in, in probably 15 minutes. The street's flooded, and then 20 minutes later, it's sunny out. Like, it's it's awesome. Like, you get all the rain you need to not be in a drought, but it's not raining, like, all year. Or it's not raining, like, the entire day and it ruins your whole day. You get you get an inch, and then it all just kind of stops. And then you can go, you know, you go on about your day, and you're like, oh, cool. That was fun. We got the rain we needed. We just, so one thing that they didn't do out here, uh, when, when they built the house, was put gutters on it. And I'm like, why isn't that a thing? So we, just before, you know, this, this winter happened, we put gutters on the house and then we put gutters on, on the game room too. It's helped a ton. Oh. I mean, obviously, gutters on the house is a, is, a, is a thing you want. But just on the game room, even, like, keeping the water away from, like, the walls. Because it, it was, like, 
getting to a point where it would get close to flooding. Uh, so yeah, it just helped a ton. Like, and you can collect rainwater out here, and it's not illegal. So we're gonna do that. So when we have the garden going, we can just water off the collection, the rain barrels. This is gonna be a tough shot too. But yeah, gutters. They're awesome. <laughs> you never you never know what you miss until you don't have it. Like we lived the first winter here. No no gutters and it was like you can't even walk out of the front door like there's just rain pouring off the roof. <laughs> Cuz it rains like this. Yeah, you want to direct the water exactly. Are the skunks bigger in Texas? I mean, this thing looked... No, no, I don't think so. It looked like a cat when I saw it. But no, I don't think they're bigger. Everything else is bigger in Texas, but maybe the skunks. But yeah, it's coming down right now. Yeah, thanks, Johnny. That was a, a nice way to end the shit round. I didn't have great shots on some of those, but we'll, we'll get there. Sometimes I have, I have to slow down. Like I end up making shots too quick, and I'm like, oh, I should have paid attention. Just for a hair longer, if I would have looked at it. Do like this one. I'm purpose. I'm gonna hit it this way on purpose to go with the wind, and then hope it kind of brings it back. So it kind of helps. But using that the backspin ball really does help when you're going towards the green. Longest drive? Yeah, I was gonna say that was a good shot. So there's a ton of wind. Sit. Nice. So yeah, if you guys um I mean if you're playing the challenges, you'll know that this is you know A1, make sure ball go that way. C3 and make sure make sure ball go uh, right to left. Um, so yeah, the, the challenges kind of really help you get this under control. Um, but you can always see it when you're playing the shot guide that kind of tells you what you're doing to like give give the ball some curve. Oh, that's not good. I don't think that's going to be good, but. See. Yeah, I didn't think it was going to get over. I shot it too far. Oh, it was so close. Yeah, for sure. I'm going to check on the rain real quick. I feel like we've gotten a lot in a real short amount of time. Make sure nothing's flooding everywhere. Oh, jeez. What a horrible cut. 
That was garbage. At least I left you guys with the rain ambiance. Holy crap. Good girl. Yeah, it's really coming down now. This would be a perfect night to sleep in the loft up here in, in this room. Just a big rainstorm. Uh, if you like rain, like, yeah, it, it'd be like a sound machine for sure. Yeah, it's it's coming down. My wife saw. Are the, are the dogs with you? I'm like, yeah, I let them in. Don't worry. It's coming down. Try to shoot it through here. Nope. Just too much. Should I take it? Yeah. And then just do it here. Boo. Oh, the sand slowed it down. What's wrong, bud? I think the rain's scaring, scaring them. It's coming down pretty loud. You don't want to go outside, do you? Keeps walking to the door. You want to go outside? Sure. Sure. No. I yeah. 
I didn't think so. Ah. Oh. Missed an easy putt. Missed an easy putt. This is where you lose real quick when you get stuck in those sand traps. I feel like you guys might not even hear me. <laughs> You're just going to hear rain. Yeah. Paladin, uh, do you want to do more? I figure I got maybe another 30 minutes before I should go to bed. Wow, man, it's coming down. Holy crap. I'm going to try to take a video of this. I don't know if it'll come through to my life, but. Oh, now it lets up. Okay, it might be quiet enough now. All right, Johnny. Okay, yeah, let's just do two. Merry Christmas as well, Johnny. Um, I most likely won't be streaming tomorrow or Christmas, but I don't know. Some things might happen. But thanks for hanging, man. Thanks for coming in. Have a great Christmas. Enjoy it with your family. It's good seeing you as always. All right, you sent me one, and you're finishing one. Okay. Let's do it, Paul.
What? Why would it start out with such a sh short club there? Paul, I got three more of those hands printing. It's crazy to see how how fast they uh, they develop, how fast they print. Like, that's late for a plane. Interesting. But yeah, it's crazy to see how fast this thing goes and prints stuff, dude. And it's just spot on every single time so far. So I've gotten... I don't know. 40 different items printed on it already. But like even like... Not 40 different prints, but... Uh, so I printed three in one print and it was just, it's just under seven hours. So yeah, you're, you're two hours per hand, I guess. But the build plate, you know, it was big enough that I could throw three on there. I, I couldn't do more than three, which is fine. Cause they, they came out, I mean, they came out looking real good. The croc, the croc charms that I printed were freaking awesome, dude. Like I just printed letters. You know, for everybody's first and last initial in, in the family that's out here. That has Crocs. And they, they look really, really good. And they snap right into the Croc like no problem. Like just like a, a, any charm you would buy if you're a fan of Crocs. I wasn't until uh, um, Rachel's, Rachel's sister was like, oh yeah, Crocs are cool. It's like the Texas thing, I guess. I don't know. But they, they're they pretty cool. They're really comfortable. I, I went and bought ones uh, when we went to the mall last week. That are like slippers. They got like the nice furry foot, you know. Yeah, dude, it's. I I know I know you said your budget the other night. Like, if you could if you could save up the extra you know two hundred bucks in taxes, basically, it's it's so worth it. And get the um the other bed, the other magnetic bed. That this thing is nuts. Like nothing sticks to it. The print's done. You just pull up and it pops off the there it's it's their textured plate oh no that's not good yeah it's their textured plate i was like man this is killer Something just pops off of it there's no defects yet like i mean i'm sure it's, it's a 3d printed i'm sure there's going to be something yeah I, I thought Crocs were like a stupid thing, but I have like a regular pair and then 
the, the fuzzy pair, like the slipper pair. I love them. They're comfy, like my, I because I wear flip flops a lot. Obviously not during the winter as much, but in the summer I just wear flip flops, and my feet were just really starting to hurt. They don't hurt with the Crocs, like the little pads or whatever they have on there. Actually helped, helped me at least. Like my feet don't hurt anymore. Because they come out here and stand on hard ground, right? I need to get some uh, standing, like, map. Coming soon. Alright. Alright, I finished that one. Paul, I'm gonna... I'll wait for you to finish. I'm gonna play a, a league matchup. While you play the other matches. Yeah. It really is, dude. Like, I mean, I, I didn't wear the Crocs to the, to the zoo tonight because I knew we were going to be walking a lot. So I wore, like, my regular tennis shoes. But I, I will say this. The two things I wear the most... I purchased in Texas. <laughs> like, I threw away all my old sandals. I now wear Crocs and then, like, a nice pair of tennis shoes that I bought. Not having to go into an office anymore, like, really changed that for me. Like, I used to, I still have my, my nice, you know, fancy dress shoes. But I have a fuck. I have a two hundred fifty dollars pair of shoes. I don't wear them because I, I don't. You know, I don't have to go into an office anymore. I don't have to go physically see clients. I mean, I'll wear them to a, like if we go out to dinner or a fancy dinner or an event or you know, anniversary or something like that. Like, I'll wear them, but I'm not wearing Crocs and something like that. So it's nice to still have a a fancy pair of shoes, I guess. Like, my wife and I went out last year for, I think it was our anniversary. I got warm. You know, we wear the nice shoes. Dress up. Just to feel feel good, dress up for each other. I used to buy a ton of watches. I still have them all. I don't buy watches anymore. I don't wear them. That was part. That was, that was my accessory. Watches were my accessory, and uh, now it's a big waste. They just sit in my watch box and my watch boxes and nothing happens. Why are you laying on the ground? One dog decided to just lay on the ground. Okay, there's a cool little map for you guys here. I'll have to, uh, I'll, I'll set up a dog cam, Paladin. I'll just, I'll move the camera next time when they're in here. The one that I have set up a dartboard, I'll just turn it. And if they're laying on that, that mat, everybody will be able to see them. 
We'll call it the, the puppy cam. <laughs> That's not bad. Oh no. I forgot that sand dune was like massive. Cat cam, that's funny. Yeah, that's a good reminder. I really need to um, figure out how, how I can put my, my stream deck out here. Like, the computer I'm at, I don't... Uh, it won't handle it. I guess I could run a USB cable, a long one. Maybe I'll get another one. I can run a USB cable so I have it next to me. Right here. Because the computer or at least the screen that the computer is running the stream is over there. But I, I gotta figure it out. I, I need to make the stream kind of more professional like you guys do. And so it's a fucking pokey mess. Oh, I barely made it up there. Okay, I need to be able to let the redeems go. But you guys have your redeem set like a bot triggers your video, right? Maybe if I look into that, I don't need the deck necessarily but I, I should still have it out here uh oh did it trade no uh, I'm gonna push to the oh oh got it But let's see, did I win? Oh, probably not. Good start on Pine Coast, Paladin. Okay, so streamer streamer dot bot. Okay, All right, I gotta I, I gotta look at it. Kind of hospital rolling table. That's awesome, dude. I mean, your guys' stuff looks good all the time. Like it sounds good. You got your transitions in, like. You guys spent a lot of time on making your stream what it is. I'm just kind of here for fun, you know? Which I know you guys are there for fun too, but...
breaking off some supports. That's also the other thing I, I notice about this printer compared to the other printers that I, that I had in the past. And it, it could just be uh, their slicer, their software. But the way it, like, if you have to print something with supports, like, it's, it, it tells you. It's like, hey, uh, you should probably put supports here. Let me optimize the print for you. And you're like, okay. But the supports just come off. Like, they're not so attached to your print because the print was already kind of lopsided as it was printing. It's so level that everything just comes out, like, the way it should. Pull it off. And you're done. Uh, the thunder's rolling in. You hear it now. But yeah, man, these fingers look so real. Awesome. I think people are going to love them for Christmas just as a fun, fun little thing. Rain's coming down again. Oh, that's cool, dude. Yeah. Send, send it to me. I'll print it. I'll, I'll send you one. I mean, if, do you have one that's, like, good? Like, good quality? But I'll print it regardless. I'll print a bunch of them. All right, I'm going to do one. I'm going to do one more. Oh, man. Pretty sure I lost this guy here. But I'm going to do one more league matchup and then I'll probably call it quits on the stream. Yeah, dude, send, send it to me. If I, if I get one, if, if it works, I mean, tell me how many you want me to send you. I'll, I'll tell me what color. You want me to print it in? I'll send it to you as a New Year's gift. But yeah, they're like I was saying, they're they're slicer. The, the software is. I mean, I, I paid for. I don't even remember Prusa or whatever the 
fuck one of them I paid for the software. And, and maybe it's changed now in, in the last, you know, two years. Um, but Bamboo Labs software is so easy. And it, like I said, it tells you, it's like, hey, uh, you should probably put supports somewhere. Let me do it for you. And you're like, okay. Or the model needs some simplifying and there's too much garbage in it. Let me simplify it for you. Okay. So yeah, I, yeah, send me send me the thing, man. We'll uh Oh I might be able to print it tomorrow. I only have Oh the same fucking putt twice. I only have a handful of things I need to print, and they're small things, so. Once I get the small things done. Oh, man. Sorry, dude. Okay, so. Did you hear? Okay, so send. Send me the STL. And I'll print it. I'm. If it works, I'll send it to you as a New Year's gift and tell me how many you want and what color. So I have I have some glow in the dark left. Like I printed those I, those foldable reindeers in glow in the dark, and they like I'm gonna lose this. They they glow they glow in the dark green. It was pretty fucking cool. Oh okay so okay but you heard like send me the STL file if it works. Um, I'll, I'll send you some. Just tell me what color you want. Because I, I only have, a, like I said, I only have a couple things I need to print tomorrow just to kind of get, get done for, you know, little Christmas surprises for everybody. And then that's it, yeah. But this rain is still just fucking hammering down. Yeah, cool. Uh, but yeah, like I said, if um, if I get everything done for Christmas, I'll just print it. Just tell me. I mean, we'll we'll talk on Discord. Just tell me what color you want. Which I should I should be able to get everything done. The the croc charms. The croc charms don't take long, which is really cool. Like, I printed... I don't know how many... <laughs> One, two, three, four... Five... I printed 14 of them. All, all in the same, like, single print. I printed 14 of them in, like, an hour. Probably less. Probably 45 minutes. So I just have to, after I get a, a round of these hands done now, like they're printing now, 
Uh, I just gotta do a, a few more of those crotch charm, the, the crotch charm things. And that's it for what I wanted to do for Christmas, for family at least. So yeah, I'll, I'll have time then. Oh, I'm gonna get an eagle on this. Now it's, it's still. I had a bogey. Alright, sweet. Yeah, I'll, I'll look at it tomorrow for sure. The fuck is this? Casino things are sending me ads. Fuck out of here. It's like real casinos. Ah. Uh. All right, let's redo that. Pretty sure I lost that one too. Oh no, I won. Sweet. Had a strong finish after that crap start. Oh, you finished one. Let's see. What'd you do? Minus three. Okay. Last hole didn't help you. All right, man. I'm gonna. Oh, I guess I'll play the play the daily shot real quick. Oh, the L was for the loss? Yeah. So let's let's watch the ad. I don't know. In the chest, I I feel like sometimes you you can get Dear Solitaire Lovers. Are you still uh mulligans out of this? These ads suck uh, for so long. Oh, it restarted. Oh, you suck. All right.
used to. No, didn't get any mulligans. <laughs> Is it casino danger? It could be. Spend it. Spend it all. All right, man. Thanks for uh, hanging. I hope you feel better, dude. I I wish you could. Uh, I mean, I hope you get to spend some time with your family on Christmas Day. Hopefully, you, you, you test negative or. But uh. But yeah, I'll I'll be talking to you tomorrow for sure. Obviously, we'll get get that print rolling. And see what we can do. Yeah, have a good night, bro. I will talk to you tomorrow. Yeah. You know me. We're always around too, right? I'll probably be texting you in five minutes anyways. <laughs> All right, man. Thanks for hanging.